Hi YouTube, welcome to the Wooden Class Art Channel. My name's Gary. Have you ever built a miniature picnic bench or a stained glass umbrella? Yeah, me neither, until now. The inspiration behind this creation was a picture I came across last summer showing a squirrel sitting on a feeder made to look like a picnic bench. And you know, until I, I saw that picture, it had never occurred to me how on earth these creatures are supposed to have a nice dinner without a table to sit at. I mean, seriously, had it never crossed my mind until then that they had no place to eat. <laughs> Anyways, once I saw that picture, I knew I needed to build one for all the birds and squirrels who call our maple tree their home. So I designed and built a prototype and hung it in the tree. It was quite the hit with the local wildlife throughout the summer until the rainy season hit and the food dish turned into a bowl of soup. And with that, I took the table down for the season and brainstormed how to design a shelter for the food. It had dawned on me one day while sitting at a pub. A simple umbrella would work. So with that, let me tell you about this crazy project of mine. I refined the prototype design and built it more like a piece of furniture using 100 year old reclaimed lumber. As well, with, to withstand the elements, I used brass fittings and applied a coat of exterior stain. I'm always thinking of ways to combine wood and stained glass. I knew the umbrella needed to be built from glass and its construction would be no different than building a stained glass lampshade just a little shallower. I knew the shape and size I wanted, and I knew I wouldn't find a mold online. So I spent time looking through the local thrift stores until I finally found a serving bowl with the shape and size I was looking for. This cost a little over two bucks and it's a perfect shape. With that, using a compass and ruler, I segmented the bowl into six sections and created my pattern shape. Now to keep the nice curved shape of the bowl, I calculated that the pieces of glass couldn't be more than an inch and a quarter long any longer and it would create a visual flat area in the curved shape. Now, to complement nature, I wanted the motif to be a flower and the size of the pieces of glass really dictated what type of flower I'd use as an inspiration. And after a bit of study, I settled on a dahlia. The umbrella stem is a piece of quarter inch brass rod and is soldered to the umbrella's center ring. The glass umbrella is further supported with a custom-made three-pronged spider fitter creating a second connection point from the glass to the rod. The bench measures 11 by 11 by 6 inches and the umbrella is 10 inches in diameter and consists of 144 pieces of yellow, green and blue opaque glass. I hope you'll enjoy watching the creative process unfold and don't forget to hit subscribe if you'd like to follow me on future projects. I'm always creating. As well, if you'd like to see some other projects I've done, please check out my website. That said, let me show you.
I'm so the bunny. It was shed as by the gun. Hell the scream, so in fall, no one cry. I'm so the mother, she was pretty.